Hello, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome back to another episode of From Ra- No, no, it's not From Rags to Riches. Sorry. Uh, but what it is, it is me making commas. And uh, basically, so I have my Echo Flip here. This is uh, the Echo Flip I'm using for my Kohler Rush series. If you guys aren't interested in PvP and are not watching that, then, uh, you know, this won't interest- Then you don't know about this character, I suppose. But uh, on Elizael right now, this is Elizael. I don't know how I can show you. Maybe here? Some okay, anyway. No, I can't. But anyway. So this is my character. Uh, he's cur I'm currently level 43, and uh, I just moved up from my Peewee set to my Quack set. So I have a Vital Vitality Overmage Quack set, and I have this, and I have a few commas. I have 300,000. I didn't make these commas by myself on Elizael. I already had a character here, and I've received two donations. One I showed previously, and one that I'll show on the screen right now of this shield and like some commas. Uh, anyways, but as I move up further on uh, along, I'll need better and better gear, and I know I'm going to need more commas. So right now, I've given myself exactly 300,000 commas, and here I have what's left, which is only 44, but I just want it to be like this so we can keep track of our commas. So I need to make commas, just so that I can buy good gear for my colo. Uh, my rating right now is like 900, and you know, we're moving up. I can, you can see I'm starting to stack some colo tokens and such. So uh, we're, we're doing really well with the uh, Echo Flip. I'm really starting to like it. I bought a few spells. I now have like summoning of Arachne and just weapon skill and whatever. So it's really cool. But anyways, uh, we're going to go make some commas. Uh, we're not going to do it solely in crushing. I might incorporate a little bit of crushing to this video. But my main goal is actually going to be le uh, maging. Because uh, here, you know, Elizeo actually has a moving economy, especially for like low levels. It has a very big low level economy. So things that you do at low level, like, uh, like small mages and that sort of thing, and like low level items, they'll actually sell. Uh, as opposed to on Echo, where I am doing, where I was doing my Rags to Riches series, which is now on pause. As opposed to on there, where like low-level items would never sell for for anything. Once again, sorry if there's background noise. I can't. I just can't help it. But anyway, so I'm gonna be looking at items. I'm gonna pick out a few, and I, basically I'm gonna be going for Vitality over Mages. Like over here, you can see Vitality over Mages, right? But like it's so if you go here, the base price is like what seven thousand five hundred, right? And like, let's say we look further along, there's Vitality over Mages, and then they, they're like 20,000. Does it cost 20,000 to Mage? I don't know, but we're going to Mage a bunch of items and we're going to see. I'll pick out a few and uh, we'll meet each other in a sec. Alright, so it took a little bit of looking in the market, but I finally decided. I'm going to make two sets, uh, the Earth Quack set, Earth Quack set and the Fire Quack set, because those seem to be the most expensive in the market. Uh, I would have also done the Air Quack set. But I know that at this level, people would probably go for other air items like Mad Tofu Cloak and like Toe ID, that sort of thing. So instead, I'm going to leave those. I'm going to do those, but I know I'm going to need a lot of Pav Vitality Runes. So I'm going to try crush these two items for Pav Vitality Runes. Uh, well, just Vitality Runes, and I'll make them into Pav Vitality Runes. I chose these because, uh, like as you can see, this one has heals. If you guys remember anything from my Rags to Riches series, right? In crushing, you want, uh, you want something with sync. This one has Wisdom, which is good sync, and heals as well. And uh, this one here, solid, not as good, but it has like some dodge on there and and decently high chance, and they're not that expensive to make. Uh, this one's a little bit more. I'll probably probably cost me around fifty thousand to make ten of these, and this one won't cost me as much. This one will cost me like uh, maybe three thousand, thirty-five thousand or so. And then I'm gonna craft one earth quack set, one fire quack set. If I have the commas, hopefully I will. If not, maybe I'll cheat a little bit by taking from here. But I'll I'll tell you guys. So. We, we can still keep track of our cameras, no problem. Uh, and then we're going to go and mage them right after I craft it. I'll see you in a second. All right, I went out and bought everything. I bought it all, and uh, we started at 300,000 commas exactly. I didn't take any more from the chest, so... Uh, in total, we spent around 275-ish thousand. So 275,000. Obviously, I will need to spend some commas on runes, so I may end up taking a little bit from the chest, but obviously, I will tell you guys. Although, I... <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm so tempted to just like crush some of them just because I know they give like resistance. But I also kind of know that they'd probably be crushed to shit. So uh, I don't know. I'll probably end up maging them. Maybe I'll crush a few items of the set just to test it out. But we'll do that together. So uh, I'll go craft them and uh, we'll see you right after. There we go. So we have crafted all of our items. You can see here. I'll uh, actually sort by category so it looks pretty. There we go. So. Uh, I've crafted my two quack sets, i crafted my items 10 and 10. Uh, meanwhile, I sold some other stuff that I had, just like resources and whatever, so I'm going to collect these commas, but uh, keep in mind, so we spent basically 300,000 commas. going to collect those, I'll collect the ones from Haven Bag. I'm also going to collect whatever runes I already have. 
because uh, I had a few on the account already. So I'll collect these. I know I'll need intelligence runes, patent runes. I know I'm going to need some vitality stuff also. Uh, I know I'm going to need... Uh, and then I know I'm going to need earth resistance. No, not earth resistance. Like just uh, earth uh, strength or whatever. Okay, that's what we have. So uh, we have 60,000 commas. We spent basically 300,000. Also, we have to take in mind that I'm using my own runes. So like technically, you know, in net value or whatever you want to call it, I did spend a little bit more. Just considering the runes. But uh, let's, go, let's go start with crushing those... Uh, those 10 and 10 things, and let's see how many uh, Vitality Runes we get out of those. I think they cost me like uh, uh, 50,000 and 30,000 to craft those 10 and 10s. So, uh, I'm not sure which one was which. I think this one was 30,000. Yeah, this one was like 30,000. 30, I think this one was pretty cheap. Or something like that, 35,000, I don't know. But anyways, we're going to put them all up. So this is called La... La something. We're going to put all those. And then there was that bow, what was it called? Uh, Ikulf. There we go, gonna put all those. We're gonna make sure we focus on vital. Come on. I know they both have vitality and technically I should be able to, but sometimes the game does that where it doesn't let you focus on something. So we're just gonna have to do it again. That's pretty, pretty silly of Ankama. So let's see what we make. Vitality, it has some nice heals and stuff. So here we go, three, two, one, boom. Okay. Uh, decent. So each one made me back like 4,700 commas. And what did it cost me? Yeah, uh, I mean, it's not like I made crazy profit or anything, but <laughs> I made something. So anyways, I'm going to go to our next item now, which is the bow. Uh, that one that one had, had heals on it, and I didn't get that much. This one only has dodge, so my chances for this one, unless I have a crazy coefficient... Okay, one second. I need to tell my brother to shut up. Sorry about that quick interruption. Hopefully he's a little bit more silent now. Uh, so yeah, uh, I was just saying that that one had heals and I didn't get that much. This one only has dodge, like for my sink. So I probably won't get that much. We might end up losing a little bit, but you know, whatever. Here we go. Oh, nice. This one had a better coefficient, so it sort of made up the difference. Why did this one get me so much more? Oh, okay. there was two of them. Okay, obviously. So there was two there. What did this one cost me? Uh, 3,900, about 5,000. And then each one made me back a little bit less. I mean, okay, I basically just made back my commas on this one. But yeah, it was worth the experiment. Why not? So we're going to convert these into Pa Vitality Runes. See how many we can get of those. Uh, probably like 200 something. Let's see. 293, yeah. So we'll convert most of them. Uh, I could just convert all of them. Whatever, we'll just convert 230 of them. We'll do that. So we're going to convert that, and then I'm going to go buy some intelligence runes, some strength runes, and I'll find some maguses, 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 and we'll uh, uh, we'll get to it. Alright, finally we are done maging. It took me about 20 minutes or so. Uh, I sort of just, the problem is that I don't have my own uh, magus, so I have to like ask people, and I basically I'm dependent upon their skill. And also I couldn't find anyone at this hour, because right now it's like, what time is it? It's like 4am for the Frenchies, so a lot of people are not locked on, so I couldn't actually find any... Uh, smith mages, mages, whatever. So these these have gone unmaged. I was considering crushing them, but I think I'll just sell them the way they are. Whatever. I'll just sell them like this. I, I did mage the rest, and they turned out pretty well, actually. I kind of want to show you guys. So uh, this one, 45, 20, actually. Is this is it better than mine? No, mine's better. Because I, I would have switched it if it was better. Uh, and then you got this ring, 61. That's pretty good. Uh, here you got some nice vitality, 94. What's mine, actually? Okay, I'm going to stop comparing, whatever. I'll just sell what we what we made today. So there, you can. I'm just showing you the stats. 102. I kind of ignore everything except intelligence and uh, the vitality. Of course, I don't even care about the summons because I don't think it matters that much. And the damage there, 135. Like that's crazy. Uh, 90, 80, 88, 101, 90, 130. Uh, so I'm gonna go put these up in market, and I'll put these up in market too. So let's see, like about what kind of price we can get for this sort of thing. So we're going to have to go to the equipment market. We're going to have to run real quick. La la la. I'm hoping I can get uh, some decent commas. It won't sell right now. It'll sell by tomorrow or so, hopefully. But uh, you know what? I kind of want to also level my own uh, Magus. Because I'm I'm actually a solid Magus. I know I've never made any videos about it or anything. But um, if you guys pay really close attention, any video I do with my rogue, if you look at my gear closely, you'll see that it's actually probably maged by me. So a lot of the stuff that I have 
uh, on my rogue that's like over 100 vitality, really good stats, that sort of thing. I mage myself, so I usually mage my own items. Uh, anyway, it's going to take, take me a while to like filter through the markets and stuff, so I'll, I'll do that and then we'll pick up right after. Okay, so everything is up in market. Uh, they sort of all kind of turned out to be around 50,000 commas. Maybe I was a little bit lazy, but honestly, to be fair, I kind of undercut like what the market price was. But just because I felt like a lot of them would have sold, like according to market price, right? Like I could have put this up for like, I don't know, 70,000. But I don't just, I just don't see people buying that because it was just so cheap to, to craft and mage. And I don't, I just don't feel like people would actually buy it. So I did this price and this total comes out to, so I think it's like 12 items, right? Six items per set, two sets and uh, 50,000. So 50,000 times 12, that's like 600,000 commas. Quick maths. So uh, 600,000 commas. And we started with 300,000 and I kind of spent 300,000. So we kind of doubled our commas, which is pretty good. Uh, hopefully these will sell. If they do sell, I will let you guys know on my Discord. So if you're not part of the Discord, uh, the link's always in the description in every video. Uh, just be sure to join because I post stuff on there and like updates and I talk to you guys and everything. So make sure you join there. Uh, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I'll be trying to do some uh, leveling my Magus at the same time, that sort of thing. And I'll keep you guys updated uh, here on YouTube and on my Discord. So if you guys enjoyed this video, please subscribe, please leave a like, yada yada. I'll see you next time. Peace.